Hi everyone! Welcome back to my channel. It's Miranda time! For today's episode, as you guys can see from the title, we are doing a water taste test. Bakit? Well, para maiba lang. There have been a few comments on my channel already for a water taste test. And to be honest, hindi ko tinitik seriously yung mga nagko-comment ng water taste test sa channel ko. Especially since kapag nagre-reply ako ng seryoso ba, ang reply nila sa akin is joke lang. Kaya lang na-realize ko na bakit nga ba hindi? Kasi parang ang cool ng idea and ang interesting niya na magte-taste test tayo ng water. <laughs> Kasi di ba water yung palate cleanser ko? Tapos ngayon, yun yung titikman ko. Di ba? Gets yung ba ako? Oh my god, na aga nung gets yung ba ako. <laughs> Tapos kanina po ako tinatanong ng sisters ko kung ano daw yung palate cleanser ko. Kasi water nga yung titikman ko. I don't know. So wala tayong palate cleanser today. Since tubig lang naman sila, so wala akong i-cleanse. Before anything else, medyo nagbasa-basa kasi ako about different types of water like purified, distilled, spring water, and the like. And I suggest you read up on it. Hindi ko na itatouch yun. Dito sa si taste test natin as usual, we are going to focus on taste. And I'm really curious kung talaga bang may difference yung lasa nila dun sa tubig na hindi ganito kamahal. Okay? So, dun lang tayo. Dito tayo sa medyo chill lang na tikiman. Okay? So, I have here three boxes of water and three bottles of water. Over here sa mga nakabox ng water, which I think very unusual siya sa atin. Dito sa pinaka-right is from boxed water is better. Beside it is from just water and dito naman sa dulo is from flow. And on my left, yung mga bottles of water natin. This one is from Fiji. In the middle, this one is from Evian. And dito sa dulo, yung naka-glass bottle. This one is from Voss. Ayan, babasagin siya. Excited kasi ako. Kasi ako mamahal ng mga water na nasa harap ko. Hindi kasi ako yung tao na mapili sa water. Like, unless pangit talaga yung lasa ng tubig. Yun lang yung aayawan ko. Shocked ako kasi tubig lang sila. And excited ako. Well, kasi nga... Hindi ko naman to iniinom every day. I mean, hindi ko iniinom yung brands na to every day. So without further ado, let's start tasting. So I'm going to start tasting yung mga nakabox na water kasi ang unusual lang na nakabox sila. Usually kasi yung mga nakabox sa atin mga coconut water, 'di ba? Walang tubig na nakabox ata sa Pilipinas. May time na naging viral tong boxed water is better. Mainly because of the packaging, I think. The packaging is really, really nice and minimalist. Kaya feeling ko, ang ganda ng pagka-brand sa kanya eh. So, this one is 500ml and this one is purified water. There are a few reasons why pwede talaga maging iba-iba yung lasa ng mga tubig na iinumin nyo. One is yung pH level ng tubig and... Pwede din naman yung type ng water. So, kung interested kayo doon, I suggest you guys read more about it na lang. So, nag-google ako kung bakit nga ba mas expensive yung mga water na to versus yung normal water sa atin. Two of the main reasons na medyo same-same across the brands are advertising and yung way na pagpapackage sa kanila. Yung packaging kasi ng mga brands na to is more sustainable, more eco-friendly. So, if you wanna help Support the environment, and if you have the extra cash, and kung marti kayo sa tubig, then yun. These are the brands na pwede nyo bilhin. Okay, so tikman na natin to si Boxed Water. Dahil ang dami ko na namang sinabi. Lasan po ba? It's refreshing, yes, pero too big sa. May lasa sa e. I don't know if I'm being critical, pero may lasa sa. May aftertaste sa. May amoy din sa. Mahayong karton yon, pero may may aftertaste. Okay, so let's move on to the next one. So, this one is from Just Water. Ito, 100% spring water naman. Nothing added daw. Again, this one is responsibly sourced and sustainable din. So, sabi ko nga sa inyo, across the brands na meron dito, lahat sila mga sustainable. Kaya din, mahal sila. Kasi yung mga gamit na ng materials and yung shipping process nila, yung pag-produce nila dito, mahal. 
Parang linis nila tingnan. <laughs> Mamang tubig. Okay, no. This one is more refreshing and ito sure ako wala tong aftertaste at all. Hindi, tub ano lang siya talaga. As in, literal tubig, walang kahit ano. Itong box water may something eh. May iba siyang lasa. Oh my God. Hmm. Ang galing. Ang kakaaliw. Tubig lang pero may lasa. <laughs> By the way, itong mga nasa harap ko ngayon, sila yung mga brands of water that are more expensive versus yung mga local brands natin. And sila yung andito because I feel like, para sa akin, sila yung mga hindi mo bibili no na normal day and sila yung mas nakaka-curious na i-taste test. If you want me to do a local version or a more affordable version of this taste test, just let me know in the comment section, okay? The last one for the paper or the boxed water is from Flow. Ito naman is alkaline spring water and then 100% natural din siya. Itong si Flo, medyo may lasa siya. Gets yung ba ko? Yung parang lasa siyang malabo, ganun. <laughs> yung, yung parang pag sinahin mo siya, hindi siya kulay tubig, ganun. Ganun yung lasa niya. Ang labo kong kausap. <laughs> hindi siya kasing linaw ng lasa nitong Just Water. <laughs> It's not as... Fresh and as pure as this one. <laughs> Ang galing. Okay, may difference pa rin pala talaga yung tubig. Apparently, meron. Pero pareho silang spring water, ha? Both spring water itong dalawa. And may difference yung lasa nila. So now, let's move on here. Yung mga nakabote. And I'm going to start with Fiji. This reminds me of my best friend kasi from Fiji siya. Itong si Fiji, every time I see this, parang ang linis-linis niyang tingnan. It looks so clear and pure. Kaya parang feeling mo ang mahal niya tingnan. It looks so expensive. Ganun, ganun yung feels niya to. Kasi parang ang linis niya talaga. Uy, masarap siya. Wala siyang aftertaste and Ang fresh! Sobrang refreshing itong water na to. And I like this one. Okay, sige. This one is really, really good. Ito walang aftertaste at all. Parang feeling mo, pure na pure yung iniinom mo. And sabi dun sa nabasa ko kasi kanina, you should taste test water at room temperature. Dun mo makikita yung texture ng water. And ito, okay na okay yung texture nito eh. This one kasi medyo parang makapal siya. Dun ko sinasabi na parang feeling mo ang labo ng tubig ganun. Kasi medyo makapal tong water nito. Ito okay siya. As in, okay na okay yung texture, yung ang daling lunukin. Basta okay, okay to. Nakakatawa kasi, I got this one from SNR and pack of six siya. So, ang saya ko kasi, anim to, oh my god. Magpifiling mayaman mo na ako na Fiji yung tubig ko. <laughs> and then next, this one is from Evian. Oh, ito. Medyo thicker siya versus this one eh. This water is kind of similar with this one. Dito kay Flo. Oo. Medyo similar siya. Although, may aftertaste siya, but it's not as strong as itong kay Flo. Ito kasi yung kay Flo, medyo powdery yung aftertaste. Dito kay Evian. Pero meron talaga eh. Which I'm sure, kung iinumin mo siya ng shield, wala naman siguro. Pero, yun kasi yung sinasabi nila. At room temperature, dun mo makikita kung ano talaga yung lasa ng tubig. And nakikita natin kung ano talaga yung pinakamasarap na water and most likely, pinaka-worth your money. ba? Diba? Ang gali. Tubig lang ng lalaban-laban. Oh my gosh. And then, lastly, this one is from Voss. Itong si Voss, medyo mahal siya. Which I guess is because of the packaging since it's glass, it's reusable. And ito din, I think ito yung menjo naging hype na water last year. Silang dalawa talaga yung hype. And I guess it's also because of the packaging. Yan, very minimalist din siya. And reusable. So, feeling ko kaya nagusta ng mga tao last year. Hmm. 
This one, may konti siyang aftertaste. The texture is okay, pero not as smooth as yung Fiji. It's just weird, kasi pag i-compare mo yung tatlong bottled water natin, itong si Voss lang yung parang may small bubbles inside. Ano bang gagawin ko? I think it's time to rank. Kasi, ang gagawin kong ranking is one for boxed water and one for bottled water. Medyo clear naman sa akin kung ano yung ranking eh. So, let's rank! Feeling ko ito yung video na napakadaling hulaan, yung ranking natin. So, hindi na ako magpapaligoy-ligoy pa. Okay, so for the boxed water, ang third place natin is really surprising for me because ito yung pinaka-hype among these three. To be honest, siya nga lang yung kilala ko dito sa tatlo. Medyo surprised ako na hindi ko siya sobrang nagustuhan and ganun yung lasa niya. Medyo lasa siyang karton. Hindi ako makain ng karton pero you get what I mean pag sinasabi natin na lasa siyang karton. At kinuha ko na siya. <laughs> so third place goes to box water is better. And titikman ko siya ulit. I'm going to give it another chance. Yun talaga. Alam niyo parang lasa ng karton, lasa ng pabango, may naamoy ka din. Hindi kasi talaga siya masarap. Oh? Alam mo yung kapag sobrang particular ka sa tubig, hindi mo to magugustuhan. Kasi hindi mo siya iinom, hindi mo siya bibilhin. Second place, second place goes to Flor. Flor? Flow, flow. <laughs> Second place goes to Flow. This one is a little bit better. Kaya lang, medyo may aftertaste pa din siya and medyo makapal tong tubig na to. Hmm? May aftertaste. So, yun lang naman yung reason niya. But it's a good water. Malamang. Too big. Kaya lang, hindi siya sobrang refreshing because may aftertaste. So, this one is second place. Which leaves us to the winner dun sa mga boxed water natin, si Just Water. Sobrang refreshing nito. As in, nakaka-amaze. Mm, walang lasang karton. Tsaka, hindi masyadong amoy karton. Nakakatuwa. Ito medyo lasang coconut eh. Parang ganun yung aftertaste. Ito, kakaiba. Hindi ko alam. Ito, okay to. So, kung gusto nyo ng boxed water kasi gusto nyo tumulong sa environment, just go for this one. And then, let's proceed to the bottled portion. Bottled portion. So, the third place goes to Evian. This is really surprising for me. I thought, masarap si Evian. I don't know why. Maybe because of the branding. Sobrang ganda ng branding ni Evian eh. Parang feeling mo, uy, Evian social. Uy, Evian, masarap na tubig yan. Hindi ko na-realize na hindi ganun kasarap. I'm sad na third place lang siya. And then, second place, second place goes to, gets nyo naman na, Voss Water. I don't have a lot of complaints about this one. Well, sakto lang siyang tubig. Wala siya masyadong aftertaste. It's just that, sakto lang siya. This is something na hindi ko na siguro bibilihin ulit. Just because sakto lang siya. And as I said, hindi naman ako ma-artist sa tubig. And hindi ko naman na kailangan tong recyclable bottle niya. And mahal siya. And for sakto lang na tubig, I don't need it. But itong winner natin, yung champion natin for today's taste test sa bottled, <laughs> sa bottled portion si Fiji. Ito yung bottled water na bibilhin ko pa siya ulit kapag uh, yung parang gusto kong gumastos. May pera ako, ganun. Yung gusto kong magmayaman. Masarap kasi siya talaga. You have to try this kung, kung willing ka gumastos. <laughs> kasi it's a bit expensive for water. Aminin na natin, medyo mahal nga siya. Pero, ito yung masasabi ko na worth it. It's really good. It's really refreshing. And, guys, ang linaw-linaw niya. Kita niyo ba ako? Siyempre hindi, di ba? <laughs> mm, walang aftertaste. So, I'm really impressed. Kung magtatry lang kayo ng isa, out of everything that I have here, I suggest ito kayo kay Fiji. I like this better over this one. Yun nga lang ito, naka-bottle pa din, naka-plastic bottle pa din versus this one na naka-paper. Pero, dun sa, dun sa water, as in dun sa tubig talaga, mas masarap pa din talaga si Fiji. Baka may factor din talaga yung packaging na ginamit. I'm not really sure. But, ito talaga yung dalawang best. Pero si Fiji, ang best of the best. And this is the one that I really, really liked out of everything that I've tried. So, Yon, that's it. It's the end of another video. If you enjoyed this video, kindly give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye!